charged in the brutal beating of his sister's girlfriend last Thanksgiving has been found guilty. Travis Hawkins Jr. was charged with second degree assault in the beating of Valerie Owens, but the jury found him guilty of the lesser charge of third degree assault. Fox 10 News reporter Steve Alexander was in the courtroom. He's joining us live now from Government Plaza with the details. Steve? The jury deliberated about 90 minutes before reaching a verdict, but there is a very big difference between second degree assault and third degree assault. And appealing the case, as Hawkins' attorney did, can mean freedom. The jury found Travis Hawkins Jr. guilty of third degree assault, not second degree assault, his original charge. Second degree assault is a felony punishable by a maximum of 10 years in jail. Third degree assault is a misdemeanor punishable by a maximum of one year. How do you feel about the sentence? Mallory Owens left the courtroom without speaking. So did her girlfriend, Hawkins' sister, Allie. Hawkins and his attorney, James Bird, also left without speaking. District Attorney Ashley Rich said she was disappointed with the verdict. There were certain things in this trial that could not be introduced um, because the law says they're not admissible. Jail records show Travis Hawkins Jr. was arrested last month for third degree domestic violence and for harassing communications in December of 2012, less than a month after he was charged in the beating of Mallory Owens. I just only wish that, you know, the, the facts of the violent nature of this young man, um, his history, of domestic violence would have been admissible. I would have, you know, it would. Have, I think the jury's decision would have been different. Hawkins was sentenced to a year in jail, split 90 days. That means after serving three months in Metro Jail, he can be on probation for two years. But because Hawkins' attorney is appealing, Rich says he can get out of jail as soon as he posts a $3,000 bond. He's not going to serve any jail time right now. He's bonding out. His attorney's already said he's bonding out, and he's going to get right back out in the community this afternoon. This is a picture of Mallory Owens after she was beaten on Thanksgiving Day of 2012. How concerned are you about Mallory's future safety? You know, Mallory is an extremely bright, talented young woman, and I think she will move forward and make good and wise choices in her life. Um, and not have anything to do with this man. And by the way, jail records show Travis Hawkins Jr. has been released from Metro. Reporting live from downtown Mobile, Steve Alexander, Fox 10 News. Thank you, Steve. Hey, we'll have a closer